Hello! Today I will be doing a two color bloom swipe from a failed bloom technique. Coming up. If this is your first time watching my videos, thanks for dropping by and welcome. This channel is mostly about acrylic pouring, but I sometimes do other art forms. Today I will be showing you how to fix a failed bloom and also a new cell activator that my sister Diane discovered. Get comfortable and enjoy. Welcome back. I'll show you the ingredients that I'm using and my paints. I'm going to be using Amsterdam Prussian Blue Thalo. Awesome color. And also another awesome color is Rose Matter by Arteza. My pillow is going to be Glidden Premium Satin White Paint today. Satin White Paint. And my pouring medium is also Glidden Premium Accent Base. Semi-gloss interior mixed with Atelier uh, gloss varnish. And my cell activator will be gesso, acrylic gesso, white gesso, dollar rowney mixed with Amsterdam Titanium White and some water and my recipe for that and the rest pouring medium will be in the description below my uh, video so um, let's get started all right I am going to add the pillow paint Okay, and I'm going to add the paint on. Before I do that, because it's a brand new can of paint, I'm going to just see if I have any air bubbles. This is the Rose Matter. Um, it's an awesome, awesome color. I love it. I have a small tube of it, so I'm going to try and buy some more before I run out. And this air, this paint has lots of air bubbles in it, and I don't know why because I mixed them yesterday, last night. 
So I'm going to try and see if I can just pop some air bubbles first before I begin. I'm going to add more to the outside. Since it's just two colors, I'm not sure I have enough paint on here, so... Alrighty, for my cell activator. Just going to lower the camera a bit so you can see. Looking so great. Dear. Well, I'm not having very much luck today. It's not great. A lot of white showing up here. Try and swipe it. Let's see what happens. I might add more. I'm going to add some more paint. So I'm going to change the camera angle for you. The cells are starting to develop. But as you can see, there's a lot of white. I mean, it looks nice here. So I'm gonna swipe it. I'm gonna add a little bit more paint here. 
use up my red. So I only have a little bit left. <clears throat> and I think I'm going to swipe it with my black. because there's too much white on there already. And it's my Dollar Rowney Gesso mixed with Amsterdam Black Oxide. So it's gesso and paint. So I'm gonna add some more blue too. Should do a, I should do a reverse dip on this. <laughs> All right, torch to get any air bubbles out. And here I go. cards here um, and before I start I'm going to add uh, I can clean this up after okay here I go, here I go. I'm adding my black activator, cell activator on a card. Like this. And swiping. Okay, so which way should I do it? That looks awesome already. Awesome. Okay. Where should I go next? I gotta go this way because I gotta bring the color out. And so if I go this way, I'll bring a lot of the white over. So. Just gonna swipe the same way. Yeah, 
these card that you use the cardboard gets soft after you use it once or twice so I just I'm just gonna cut that off like that and then I've got a better edge now one of these swipes for a while. I've been doing a lot of balloons, so I'm enjoying this. spinning it much because I really like it. I'm going to spin it a little bit after I finish. As you can see, this gesso works just fine. It works way better with this kind of swipe. I was having trouble blowing, so. And that's probably going to spin off too, so I think that's just perfect. Gently at first. Let's see how it goes. Okay, it's all starting to go down the sides. Beautiful. don't want to do any more. I don't think I should spin it anymore. Just touching up some sides here because it looks like wasn't enough paint. That's nice. They're all nice. A little bit of paint there. Oh, yeah. Beautiful. That's it. I'm not really touching it anymore. I love it. Yes. Yes, yes, yes. I'm going to show you a close-up, but I'm going to lift it up to the camera. My hands are a mess. And then um, at the end of this video, I will uh, show you the dried results. So I'm just going to bring it up here and show you how gorgeous this is. Two colors. Two colors. And a black CA. Alright, awesome. Love it. I do love this. 
Welcome back to my dried results. It's not completely dry. It's a little damp in the middle. Just where that, uh, it's a little bit um, glossy there in the middle. I mean, it's glossy everywhere else, but it's wet in the middle. So I won't touch it. It dried really nice so far. <laughs> um, I'll show you uh, on an angle just to show you. Yes, and I will bring you down for a close up. This black really worked good. Black mixed with uh, gesso, white gesso. I just want to show you, just to show you that white does work. I was having problems before this, so I did a little test before I started my bloom, just to make sure that uh, the colors look good together and everything. And this is the white gesso, worked really well. worked great for a tester but um, my final my attempt on this canvas it didn't work so that's why I had to swipe but it uh, works as you can see it works pretty good okay so um, thank you for watching if you enjoyed my video uh, please subscribe and like if you uh, haven't already and uh, check out some of my other um, videos that are popping up on the screen and uh, have a wonderful day so thanks again for watching see you next time